Oh, good. I didn't know you were going to be back. Um, close your eyes. I have a surprise for you. Oh, Rory. Close your eyes. Can we just... Close your eyes. I have a surprise for you. Okay, but can you turn this down, please? Close your eyes. Okay, open. Ta-da! <laughs> Is that supposed to be us? Yeah. Although you're far more glamorous, beautiful and sexy in real life. Mm -hmm. But I actually think... <laughs> this is draft three, by the way. Three? Mm. Mm. The spike looking no better than draft one. I give up. I wonder if maybe baking isn't for you. <laughs> you think? No, you know what? It's very, very sweet of you. And you know what? It's going to taste better than it looks. I probably hope so. <laughs> Such a kid. Mm -hmm. Make a wish. So, how was the start? Well, it was, it was nice. Well needed. Good. I told you, you're so busy putting everyone else first, it doesn't do you any harm to put yourself first for once. Yeah, I'm a doctor, Rory. I don't have that time. So you say. Anyway, tell me what you think of that. Well? It's nice. Yeah? Lemon. Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, I like it. Thank you. <laughs> Some bubbles. And a toast. To my beautiful girlfriend. Happy birthday. Thank you. Mm. Oh my god, that is surprisingly good. It's only a cheap bottle. <sighs> Come on, like, wait, get it down, yeah? Look, we're celebrating. Okay, we'll have a few drinks, then we'll head into town. It's not every day that someone turns 50 and looks as fit as you. Rory. Is everything okay? I'm pregnant. Pregnant? Yeah. <laughs> no way. No fucking way. Rory. I'm gonna be a dad, you're no. gonna be a mum, we're gonna be a family. Rory, I'm gonna please. call my mum, she's gonna be so excited. Her first grandchild. Don't do that, please. What? Why? Why? Carla, why should I call my mum? Because I'm not keeping it. So why did you tell me? Because I thought you had a right to know. I didn't want to lie to you. <laughs> why are you laughing? Is this a joke? No. Why, why would I joke about something? Because you don't tell someone you're having a baby one minute and then the next you're flushing it away. I would, I would never joke about something like this. Please don't say it like that. 
I thought you had a right to know, okay? I didn't want to lie to you. I'm sorry. Well, where she fucking hides? I would never make a decision like this behind your back. No, but you'll make the decision for me, won't you? That's not fair, Rory. No, it's not. Please don't drink. I don't want to have this conversation with you. I'm going to get drunk. Do you know how difficult it is for a woman my age to have a successful pregnancy? There are complications, Rory. I could lose this baby. I could have stillbirth. I mean, the baby could have Down syndrome. God, it's not as easy for a woman my age. There are so many risks. But you haven't even asked how I feel or what I want. Rory, I will be 70 when this child is 20. That's going to demand more support from you. I cannot be the mother to this child that it will deserve. That's not fair on the baby. It's not fair on you. It's not fair on me. But what if I'm cool with that, Carla? Okay, we can make this work. You've already raised two children by yourself. You're like the best mom ever. You're a pro. <laughs> exactly. I've, I've done this twice. And honestly, I don't want to do it again. God, it's hard enough when you're 25, let alone when you're bloody 50. You know, I'd have to take time off of work. I don't want to do that. I love my job. It's who I am. Okay, so I have to miss out because you've done it twice already and I come second best to your career. Is that what you're saying? No, of course not. It's but I cannot do this again, Rory. I won't. Do you know what? No wonder your husband left you. I'm gonna get some fresh air. Nice. Sorry, I shouldn't have said that. Come here. You would make an amazing father, and you have your whole life ahead of you. Oh, please. Listen, you, you should find someone your own age who can oh. give you what you want. I know how badly you want a family one day. I cannot be the one to deny you that. that I don't want anyone else. I want you. Listen to me. After my divorce, I, I didn't think that I would ever feel this way again. But you've made me feel so happy and alive. And you brought out a side to me I didn't even know existed. And I have loved every moment of our time together. Please, I'm setting you free. God. Just don't, just don't go alone. What? I'll come with you.